What is up guys, back in today with another reaction to the Show Shimon series, this time with episode 6. Uh, looking forward to this one, last episode was pretty good. It was a pretty fun episode with the whole, um, what, what were they, like donut filled mustard, but it was actually filled with spicy stuff. Pretty cool, I, I wish we saw a little bit more of, um, well, I wish we kind of saw our main character eat it. <laughs> we saw a little bit of reactions from her, but it was a fun episode. I have had a little sneak peek at today's episode because I, I wanted to check the sound, but then I realised that I've actually got to mute the series because of copyright. But it looks like we're at like some kind of festival or something, I think. I did... Uh, I... I mentioned this about myself last week about I feel like people can feel like they're too smart watching the show. <laughs> it sounds weird, but I feel like people keep like bringing up certain things of like, oh, this doesn't make this doesn't make sense, this doesn't make sense, blah blah blah. Where pretty much every single comment I've seen like that has like been explained through the episode. I don't know. They're like, um, well, in this current generation with internet everyone thinks their opinions and so even what i'm doing now making these videos everyone thinks their opinions of some importance because social media whereas i don't think that was a thing before you saw like a lot less of like celebrities and such and because of anonymity as well it's also a powerful thing again i think people were uh, maybe pretending to be super smart like oh yeah this uh this didn't make sense but again pretty much every comment i've seen like that it's actually wrong Never mind, there's flaws in the show. Flaws in some logic. Bound to be. <laughs> Ow. Those things must hurt like hell. But the shin, like the worst place. Yes. Ouch. It broke his shin. And that's a little bit of her extreme nature coming out of it there, perhaps. <clears throat> she thinks that's light as hell, I bet. I mean, he, he only teased her a little bit. I feel bad for the pole souls like we saw a few episodes ago that um that have to deal with her wrath. Oh, I hope she's got multiple locks on that thing now. <laughs> but I'm not really sure that matters. If someone's got a lock breaker, they can break many a lock, so maybe one's enough. This is what I was talking about a few episodes ago with the whole student council thing. That's not weird if you go to the student, uh, student council, like the faculty and such, where they have like, meetings and get in a little bit of trouble. Ordinary people do get in a bit of trouble. If you're a perfect student, I think that might be more... Uh, I don't know, people will start looking for the flaws a bit more, perhaps. Good for you. Good for you. Hopefully the opposite doesn't happen. Ooh, nice hat. Artsy.
<clears throat> yeah, what do you mean by that? <laughs> oh, so nice, sweet selection. Yeah. <laughs> I'm a bit rude. Oh. God damn, she's serious about these sweets. How, like, again, how is she this size? Then again, when I was, uh, even to some extent nowadays, I've always been one to snack and eat quite a bit, but never been overweight. I do quite a bit of fitness, so that does offset that. Whole fucking schedule. What's man? Sweets are serious. Can't leave the house. That's odd. Considering everything we've seen till now. She can't make it. Maybe it's a setup. Maybe she's setting him up. Or I don't know what. Yes, Beck. Person. This shouldn't be a big deal, should it? So what came up? Doesn't look like she's looks like a very ordinary place, doesn't it? Like stopped her going. <clears throat> I thought maybe it was her parents or something, but looks of things and yeah, she lived by herself. I believe he hasn't told her yet that there was only three. I feel like that's a mistake. <laughs> I'll let her know straight away. What is going on? Like, there's just pictures of nothing on the walls. Just colours. It's all black and white, and the pictures are just pictures of colours. Strange place this, isn't it? I feel like it also does say quite a bit. Evidently this is why she couldn't come, but what is going on? Also, from how they said the heat was on... Um, Quite worried that the desserts would also melt by now.
He's probably going to think he ate one. This <laughs> is maybe where the misunderstanding might come here. Is this a test? Is that what this is? I said earlier, is this a setup? Is it a test? Like what? Or are things just ordinary? <laughs> Now, sounds right now are aggressive. I might take my headphones off till he's done. <laughs> don't know about you guys, but there's people that are very into mukbang videos and such, but I don't really appreciate the sound of someone else eating. <laughs> that was, uh, yeah, something. Where is she? There are. But you can't eat them. You will be in a world of pain. Don't even think about it. Or only ever to yep you sneaky but like I said I can't help but feel like this is a test exquisite <laughs> How would you cover this up exactly? Hide that. Hide that. Cup of coffee and a cup of tea. Oh shit. Ah. That just. Is that just his imagination? Like, what time did you say me? It's 3 p.m. right now, it says there. And I'm pretty sure whatever time she said it was before 1 p.m. At, at the very most. What the fuck is going on? At this rate, I don't think it needs to worry. She's going to be another few hours in there. But you still got to wash the spoon. And clean up the plate. Oh, this is a task that's very hard not to get caught doing with the sounds. But she was on the phone, so. But is she actually on the phone? Ah, so you don't actually need to clean the spoon, you can just eat another one. The spoon. Okay. <laughs> Probably a better idea. <laughs> but what about the plate? Up under the plate.
Actually, it's back. Don't even say I don't think she cared too much because I'm pretty sure I might have an episode <laughs> if she found out. I thought she was going to feed him, so I was about to say, you, if you take that, you're one cheeky bastard. Take it, already one of us, and then take it a mouthful. Maybe she won't be too, what's the word for it, um, observational <laughs> towards that. I feel like that's something he could probably get away with. The amount of napkins. It's quite funny, we're kind of reversing it a little bit, aren't we? We kind of like we usually solve things, but now we're actually kind of creating a uh, a lie. Like, good or like something that we'd try and figure out. <laughs> Get that receipt out. I think it would be fair enough though, right? I mean, I'm guessing he paid for this and he went and got it. So he does kind of deserve an extra one. I think she's judging his reaction to it. He would be amazed. He was amazed the first time he did try it. And he doesn't seem too impressed right now. That doesn't mean he ate one just now. It's scary. So she has figured it all out, I think. Oh my gosh, she is terrifying. <laughs> In like the most collected way. I think they're the most scary people, aren't they? Pretty impressive she figured him out though, considering how smart he is. Indeed there was. Or is, is that even a lie? Maybe there was four. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. 
she just say we're going to rank them all? <laughs> oh my god. It didn't say that in the subtitles, but I think I heard that word in there somewhere. Oh, impressive. How was it the tissues that got him? Ah. Uh, she realised he was trying to get rid of tissues. Again, I thought she judged it from his reaction. He knows our snacks. I think I don't. I I don't know. I don't know about that. He's an intense woman. I feel like he could probably outsmart her. Out smart her. Outsmart her. Just not in the snack department. I feel like it's, if if he do, tries this with anything to do with snacks, it's just a terrible idea. <laughs> One, because she's as alert as a dog. Two, it's just dangerous. <laughs> she loves them that much. It's too dangerous. I like the kind of mix up of the formula today, though, actually. I mean, it was similar. It was similar, but again, it was more so setting up a kind of complex situation and it was a bit more uh it was it kind of addressed the negative i had of the last few episodes in terms of it actually had a bit more of a physical kind of we saw it happen you know what i'm saying it wasn't just like i said just hypotheticals and it, like it, what could and what what maybe happened and what what the probability of something happening was we actually again saw it all laid out But I did. Uh, I was gonna say I did find it quite funny that it's almost like the most gentlemanly thing, like the handkerchief. It's always been a a gentlemanly thing. Is the uh, the giveaway? I don't know why. Well, that was quite interesting. The fact that by being a gentleman and not getting out again, he actually uh, showed that he wasn't a gentleman <laughs> and stole her food. Joe, I really do like. I I forget both of their names, Kabato, and uh, I forget her name. So apologies, but uh, again, I, I'm I'm about to say this again. I can't remember her name, but um, she is at like again. She was terrifying today. She's terrifying sometimes, but I feel like her and her personality, um, just like the aura with her, is actually like really really awesome. Like one of um, again, I can't I can't say anything for sure, but one of my like. One of the most aura filled kind of characters in again in such a kind of like toned down way, but again such an aura filled character that should probably be like one of my favourites that I've seen from new anime that's come out this year. To be honest with you guys, I I just find her very entertaining, and uh, again I'm a big horror fan, so I love my like tension and stuff. And whenever it does get like whenever it could like be serious with her, I just love that kind of sense of like dread and tension of like oh what the hell is coming next. Um, and uh, of course she is adorable as well but yeah thank you guys very much for watching uh, again brilliant episode today uh i really loved the first three episodes i thought they were fantastic then episode four and five were good um five was better than four i think four was my least favorite episode but i think we picked it back up again now i i really enjoyed this episode again the slight change in formula uh, i like the usual formula so i, I, I want to see that again as well don't get me wrong but uh yeah do let me know what you guys uh, thought about this episode in the comment section leave a like on the video if you guys did enjoy it, and subscribe to the channel if you want to keep up to date i'll see you guys next week with episode seven and have a good rest of your day.